Welcome to my channel hello everyone for the continuation of such videos. You can subscribe to the channel and open the notification bell to be informed about new content. In this video, we will talk about wild boars. We will tell about the general characteristics of wild boars and how aggressive they are. Have a good time! Since the wild boar is a wild animal, it is afraid of people in general, but some wild boars attack people instead of being afraid. These attacks can cause very serious injuries. Many of the wild boar attacks take place in urban centers. Hungry wild boars descend on cities to feed themselves, and they look for food. Since wild boars are hungry, they are twice as aggressive as usual. That's why they attack almost every person they see. These attacks can even result in death. You need to know how to defend yourself so that wild boar attacks do not result in death. If you encounter a wild boar one day, I will tell you what you need to do. Be careful when choosing the path. As wild boars sleep and hide in dense thickets, you can give preference to non-bushy ways. When you encounter it at first, stay calm and slowly step backwards. Do not panic and scream this will trigger the wild boar to attack. If it's coming towards you quickly after stepping backwards, check to see if there are trees around you. If there are trees, climb the tree quickly. If there are no trees, run as fast as you can and make sharp maneuvers that will surprise the boar and make it leave you behind. Or if you are in a difficult situation, you can find a stick from somewhere and attack the wild boar, or you can hit the ground with a stick and make it scared by making a sound. Now that we've told you how to get rid of a wild boar, let's talk about the general characteristics of the wild boar. The wild boar has a large head, which extends towards the nose. It is a medium-sized mammal that shrinks a little more towards the back. It has a thick skin, consisting of a hairy upper layer. The thickness of the skin varies between 3 and 6 centimeters. Wild boar usually ranges from brown to black, red, or dark gray, depending on the location of the individual. The wild boar is an animal with incredibly poor eyesight due to its very small eyes, but they also have a long, flat nose, which allows them to have an incredibly keen sense of smell. Wild boar are nocturnal animals that appear only at night in search of food. Before waking up at dusk to find food, they sleep about 12 hours during the day, Female wild boars are relatively social animals and live in groups, which can contain between 6 and 30 individuals. These groups consist of breeding females and their offspring. However, males are alone most times of the year, except for the breeding season. Male wild boars can compete with each other by fighting for the chance to mate with the female. The wild boar is the most widely distributed land mammal on Earth, as its natural range extends from Western Europe eastward to Japan and south to the rainforests of Indonesia. Wild boars live in a variety of different habitats, including tropical forests and grasslands, but they prefer deciduous broadleaf forests where vegetation is incredibly dense. The wild boar is an omnivorous animal that feeds primarily on plants. Since wild boar feeds on young leaves, fruits, herbs and fruits, and with their hard noses, they remove roots and bulbs from the ground, about 90% of their nutrition consists of plant substances. Wild boars eat almost everything that enters their mouths and supplement their nutrition by eating eggs, rats, lizards, worms, and even snakes. The wild boar can also consume the dead body of another animal. Next up is interesting information about the wild boar. 
At the tip of the nose of the wild boar, there is a cartilaginous disc, which is supported by a small bone called pernasal, which allows the wild boar to be used as a bulldozer when looking for food. All wild boars have teeth on their lower lips, but males are larger than those of the female and curve upwards from their mouths. However, even more interestingly, on the upper lip of the males there is also a hollow tooth, which acts as a knife sharpener and constantly sharpens the lower teeth of the male, both of which can grow up to 6 centimeters in length. By subscribing to the channel, you can like the video and open the notification bell to know about new videos to see you in the next content.